Welcome to EWTV, I'm Grant DeVal. Today we've got a very special show for you. We're joined with a woman that's an actor, a movie producer, a movie writer and a TV presenter. Thank you for joining us, Renee Brack. It's a pleasure. Thanks for having me. Not a problem. And um, you, you write movies, you act in movies, you've got a TV show about movies. <laughs> what is it about movies that you love? And I go and see a lot of movies on the weekends too. Um, and I watch a lot of DVDs. I think it's the uh, modern form of storytelling. You know, back in caveman days, there would have been a lot of people sitting around the campfires passing on stories. And I think movies are a way for us to have a shared experience as, you know, a bunch of people out there, a bunch of strangers getting together and laughing together and all that sort of thing. So they're just uh, a great form of uh, entertainment. You're in the movie Chopper with Eric Banner, which is known for its one-liners. Have you got a favourite one-liner from the movie? Um, the one where I suppose he goes to visit the Neville Bartos character and Neville Bartos is going, there's no cash here, no cash. I always like the way he cash, delivered that. no cash here. <laughs> Tell him, no cash. It and always my, makes me laugh. My favourite one's where he goes, why would I shoot the man, bang, and then whiz him off to hospital at 100 miles an hour? What do I look like? Mark Brandon, Medicare, Medicare Reed. Reed. And do you know where that came from? When he rang me from Risden Prison, because I've got the little audio cassettes, that came from my interview. Really? Because I said to him, Chopper, they said you shot this guy and drove him to hospital. And he went, Renee, <laughs> why would I do that? It totally defeats the purpose of shooting them in the first place. That was with the real Chopper? Yeah, and I've really? got the little audio cassettes. I'm wow. just, yeah. Wow. Well, there you go. And um, the, the movie Chopper has made Mark, Brandon Reed uh, rich and famous. What's Not your rich, on that? famous. Right. Yeah, because there was a whole thing that went down with the producers and so on about, you know, paying him for his story, and he had to go and make a contribution of some of the money. He became the single biggest donator to a, a well-known Victorian police charity, which I think put a few noses out of joint within the police force, that's for sure. I wouldn't say he's made a lot of money out of it, but certainly he's got a lot of notoriety and fame. And, like, he's a modern-day Ned Kelly. He will go down in history as one of our most loved criminals. Okay. And you've got a show on YouTube, the Ren and Leash show. That's it. Who's Leash? Leash sits next to me at work and she uh, really wants to get into presenting and so on. And I said, well, why don't we do a little show? Because you can teach me all about getting things online because I'm very interested in the whole internet explosion. And I will try and impart little tips for you about presenting so we could just work together and do something we love, which is banging on about movies. Well, thank you very much for joining us, Renee. And we'll be with you after the break.